Hi guys, my name is Twinkle. Welcome back to my channel and today I am up with a very interesting video. I have never done this and I'm very nervous. But hey, there is always first time, right? So by the title, you already know I'm going to do a unicorn look using the Anastasia's Riveria palette. If I'm pronouncing it right, I mess up every time, I know. But this is what the palette looks like and these are the colors and I have done a first impression on this palette. So I will link it in the description box, so go ahead and watch that. So for today, I'm going to recreate someone else's look and she is one of my very, very, very favorite makeup blogger and she's from India. I'm gonna show you the picture and you will recognize her. So I'm going to create the Devasri's look and she has also done a video on this one. And like, look at the eyes, like, I mean, I am nowhere, like, she is so pretty. So I'm going to cre recreate this look. I will pop the picture here somewhere. And if you haven't check checked out her channel, go ahead and do that. She makes amazing videos. So without any chit chat, let's just start the video. So I have all my brushes here. I'm going to take something like this. So I'm first going to take this shade. It's called Bahamas. It's a beautiful hot pink color. And I'm just going to pat it in my outer V, just as she did. She did use the light color, but I feel like we can work with whatever we have, right? So let's start. And she also tried to like wing it. So I'm just gonna extend it and just try to do a sort of like a nice wing. And she did blend it very well. Oh my God. It's already looking pretty. I'm so excited for the other two shades. Okay, so let's move on. I'm going to take this fat, flat brush and I am going to take this particular shade. This is like one of my one of my favorite shades. It's called Mediterranean. And I'm going to take it on my brush. It's very pigmented. And I'm just going to apply it here on the center of my lid. I don't know how come she did it so perfectly. It's, it's close, it's close. And for my next shade, I'm going to use the seashells. And I'm gonna pat it on whatever the skin you are seeing here. My inner corners. And I'm just going to pat the shade there. And like, when I'm looking at the picture, it's like all in like one line. So I feel like using, um, glitter glue or something like that but we can work like this so just trying to do it as even as i can okay this looks very pretty I'm just going to switch the brush and I'm, I'm going to take the same shade again and just intensify. Ooh. Okay, now is it's gonna be very difficult. So I'm just going to do the inner corners and everything and then I'm just gonna fix the outer V. just taking whatever is left in my lower inner corner I'm 
Now I'm going to take the same brush uh, with which I took the Bahamas and I'm going to take the Kenny's or Cans shade and just intensify the outer corner. Now it's looking proper. Now for my mascara, I'm going to use the Inika Long Lash Mascara. Now for my lower lash line, if I'm looking at her picture, she used the blue color, like the color which is in very inner corner. And um, I don't have that, so I'm gonna use the purple one instead. And this is the ColourPop Creme Gel in the shade Piggy Bank. And I'm going to use it all over my lower lash line. I think it's looking pretty. I think so. What do you guys think? And for my upper lash line, I'm going to use whatever is left here. It's the Urban Color Intense 10 Hard Stay Cardal. So for my lipstick, I did use the Nykaa's 12M. This is the beautiful brown shade and it is looking very pretty and I am actually very happy with how it turned out. You guys be the judge how it is. Let me know in the comments section and if you like this video then subscribe to my channel and I will see you in my next video. Bye!